Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Alter Persona hitting you with another video and today you guys probably already know this Mochi Awakening is coming out and just because it is coming out and we did so good on the last Mochi Awakening video We're going to be giving out another five Mochis all you guys got to do is like subscribe turn on post notifications watch this whole video I can't say it enough. I, I appreciate all the love that I'm getting for for you know making these videos and I want you guys to be ready for Mochi Awakening. This is the best time to do it because one, you guys don't even have to do raids to, you know, get fragments. But guys, I would definitely try and get, you know, at least one of these fruits, probably a Logia, but get light. Doesn't matter if it's awakened or not, but if it's awakened, it's, you know, going to do more damage or Buddha for, for this. Because what we're about to do is basically show you guys the fastest way to get candies. I would want you guys to go to where there's a big mob. You know, if you're in C3, I would say at least Thriller Bark or here, but I would say Thriller Bark just because they're closer. And also you can get bones a lot quicker in Thriller Bark. And you know, that will just be the fastest way for you to get some because then you can, you know, get, you know, the surprise every 10 rolls, every two hours. And then you have, you know, the candies. Also, you know, kill bosses every once in a while, they have a chance of dropping, you know, candies. Uh, I don't know about bones. I think it's just Thriller Bark and bones. You can do raids, but you know, you have to have fruits for raids or, you know, spend every two hours. Well, while you're on the downtime, find a big mob, go kill them and farm these candies because right now I'm sitting at, you know, 16,000 and I barely even had to work for anything. All you need is 700 candies to get, no, actually 100 candies to get 700 frags. Now 50 to get 300. And that's, that's actually not even hard to get. And if you want to get, you know, the special Santa boat, if you guys don't have fast boats, you know, it is a lot faster in C3, but not in C2. I mean, you can get a thousand, thousand candies, but I wouldn't. Just saying, a thousand candies equals 7,000 fragments. So if you do that twice, you have enough for the awakening probably or pretty close. I just want you guys to be able to get, you know, as fast as possible on these fragments like because I don't want you to miss out on Moji Awakening. And also, I'm trying to give you guys Moji so you guys don't miss out on Moji Awakening cuz you know, I'm going to be probably one of the first ones other than, you know, some some other YouTubers to get it. And then not to mention they're probably going to be adding weapons and stuff and really cool really cool other things, you know? Probably another island because I mean this this is part 2 and for part 1 we got a whole island, a new weapon and a new fruit. Technically we're probably going to get, you know, another island awakening and some weapons, you know, or even accessories or a bow. And they put it up into three parts. I don't know what they have in store for us, but hey, it's looking pretty sweet. Look guys, like I'm just going to show you how to, you know, group these guys up. If you guys don't already know, I'm just saying it's the easiest way to get fragments. And guys, if you aren't farming these fragments, then what are you doing? Like I know the only problem I see is hackers because they're they're they are a big problem in, you know, blocks roots right now. I I don't understand it. I haven't had a problem with the hacker till I till they had the, you know, this big update for C3. That's, that's something. We're not going to talk about that in this video just because it, this is for me to get frags. My favorite place is here just because you get the most bones and then eventually you'll, you know, you get candies. Sit here, kill one, and then go, go on to the next one. I mean, I got some bones, see? And then you could potentially get candies. I mean, it, it takes a little bit because candies are harder to drop than bones, but we're trying to kill two birds with one stone. And then if you get hollow essence, go kill the boss and it'll probably drop some candies and bones. Got two candies. I mean, if you have Buddha, that's probably the best bet. But if you have, see, you see all that? Get fragments. And even if you don't want Mochi Awakening, get the fragments because an awakening might come out or you might need a stat reroll or you might need times two XP. If you get times two XP and then have like, I would say an hour or three hours of it and you have enough fragments to do law raids law raids will give you six levels for beating it once with times two exp six levels. and you guys will be max in no time especially if you're in c2 now if you're in c1 you're kind of screwed but try to get enough for times two exp if you're in c1 because then you guys can level up a lot quicker and get a logia then you won't have to deal with a lot of things this is the best time to farm on blocks fruits if you guys aren't doing it and you guys are saying it's taking too long, that's your fault. I know I'm not max level and I'm totally just throwing this out here and you guys are probably going to throw that in my face. But I'm about to be max level today because I'm going to get some time to stew EXP with all these candies I'm having. And then I'm going to go whoop 
Law's butt till I'm max level, which will be six levels and it's 2,000. 200 I mean, yes you gotta have friends but here's how we we're gonna squash that i gotta have friends one there's a blocks root server and sometimes yes people can be booty heads two i have my own server and if you guys join through the discord link and be like yo let's run some law raids or some raids for some fragments or hey let's farm or pvp the people in there will be definitely down for it as long as you know you're willing to help and we're and if I'm d and if I'm free, I'm down to help help whatever, you know? I'm usually asking my fans, hey, you wanna be in a video or hey, you wanna go do something? Like for real, I'm one hundred percent in this. The only thing I don't like is being pinged for dumb reasons. Try to join the Discord, farm these frags, because I'm trying to help you guys get better on blocks roots and have super nice things. That's why I'm giving out five mochis. But you gotta like, subscribe, turn on post notifications and also comment your discord tag because i can't contact you if you don't comment your discord tag you guys showed me so much love for getting 2k let's try and hit this again maybe even more i want i want to blow this up get a, get a lot of likes on this because the more views i get and likes i get the more money i get and the more i can give back to you guys because this is what this is what i do with my youtube i give back to you guys i'm doing this so i can potentially be a voice actor and manga artist because I'm working on that already. It's just, you know, publicity helps a lot. I love you guys. Peace.